Praise the Lord. There's an award which the person who get it will be surprised. May shed tears of joy. Let me just say this. Some years back, a young man, I, was, I heard the pastor speaking. They said, there's a mechanic in Port Agot who brings change. I said, in this town? I said, call me that mechanic. Let me see him. I said, mechanics are not known for honesty. How can a mechanic? They said, whatever you give to him, he will never take your money. I said, I don't know. I don't think it's true. I said, call him. And everybody testified that that is his nature. If you give him any money, he will bring you back the least change. And I talked to him. I said, you're a mechanic? How much do you make in a month? He said, so some amount. I said, okay, resign from being a mechanic. Come and be doing simple messengers work for us. Buy everything for us since you have integrity. And we have tested him everywhere. He has stood on integrity impeccably. He has seen billions pass through his hands. Has never taken a dime. Never stolen where every other person stole. He was, he was exempted. When others with him stole, he refused to steal. It's not that he's educated, he's a junior staff. But I said, it is not when we reward pastors we should leave those who are also honest. He doesn't have any idea. He doesn't even know. Yesterday, all day first, I saw him. I said, keep whatever it is you're doing. So he'll be shocked, he's even as I'm talking. Then I decided, I said, no. If this man has been this honest for these years, let's reward him in this anniversary. <laughs> Amen. So, he's living in a rented house somewhere because he's a very junior staff. So we decided as a commission to buy him a four-bedroom bungalow. I want Harry and Moselle to come out. You can show the picture of the house. Bring it. That's the house. It's a four bedroom bungalow. The documents are all here, signed. Whatever made you, keep it up. This is just the beginning. God bless you. Faithfulness rewards. Give Jesus a big hand. 